And uh, as I mentioned, uh, Kabiji, I do have one more surprise guest question for you. Would you like to take right. a guess as to who it could who it could be? Um, No, okay. world to choose. There's seven billion people to choose from. <laughs> seven billion Help me, yeah. Okay, no problem. So it's uh, none other than um, uh, Miss Pooja Bedi, your daughter. Uh, we actually right. reached out to her and uh, she was very nice enough to send us a question. And uh, of course, we're also fans of her mom, uh, Pratima Bedi, and uh, we read her book as well. And so uh, the question that I'd like to um, give to you from um, Pooja is this one. And her question is that, dear dad, um, your mom and dad were, were so busy with humanity and community in India. Uh, did you ever feel neglected as a child? What were your feelings then and learnings as an adult in that respect? And also, how did that impact your relationship with your own children? So yeah, there you go. The question from Ms. Pooja Baby. So there's two questions here. One is, uh, did I feel neglected uh, as a child? The answer to that is honestly no. I didn't have much as a child. We never had material things, but somehow the atmosphere in the house, which is where there's a government flat, a two bedroom government flat, or wherever we were, there was always my father was a constant presence. Um, my 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 mother who was busy at office, but um, but always loving. So I always had a sense of being loved and cared for, uh, and I knew I could always cuddle up in my father's arms and he would hold me and embrace me. I knew I could always go to my mother and, you know, lean on her and she would cuddle me. I never felt unloved or neglected. Um, nor deprived, even though we didn't have much. Um, occasionally I'd win some prizes and things would come out, think it's like Christmas, but it wasn't a materially oriented, materialistically oriented family. So, no, I did not feel deprived. How did that affect my relationship with my children? Well, it's a different situation. It's a different situation because after my divorce with Pratima, which happened for reasons of its own, um, my career took me to Italy and to Hollywood. And I realized that the children would not see as much of me, obviously, as if I li lived in India. So I tried to make amends for it. Mm -hmm. I would bring them over every vacation to America, um, spend their summer vacations with me, sometimes winter vacations. And in fact, their last three full years of high school were with me in America. But having said that, I realized that for most part, I was an absentee father. And um, could I, should I have done more? Could I have done more? Perhaps. Um, but then one, you know, in, in, in the battle for remaining in the industry, the fight for survival, the, 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 the pressure of the time, uh, you're on a different continent. You give less uh, time uh, to children than you should. And I regret that. I do regret that. I wish I could have spent more time with the children. Um, and I'm sorry. I apologize to them if I didn't spend enough time with them. But they were always close to my heart. Always. Yeah. It's, it's, it's uh, a long and deep story. <laughs> 